Welcome to Left Lion News at 12 o'clock. Today's top story, how Covid has affected the nightlife and plans of teens and young adults in Nottingham. Our reporters Eddie and Tilly went to Nottingham today to find out the public's opinion on cancelled plans, non-existing nightlife and the government's recent activities. Over to Tilly. Covid-19 has been ruining plans for millions across the UK and after recent government scandal people are wondering whether they should still withhold plans to protect the lives of others. As of today there are 15 Covid variants. The most well known are Alpha, Delta and Omicron. There have been over 50 million cases of Covid-19 in the UK and over 150,000 deaths. In the UK 52.2 million people have had their first Covid vaccine. 48 million people have had their second and 36.7 million have had their booster. Young people feel marginalised by the new Covid restriction rules and many students all over Nottingham feel as though they are missing out on the nightlife they will promise. ...require Covid passport or negative lateral flow test for entry. However, these restrictions have had a taken a toll on clubs and music venues as 82% of UK grassroots music venues were predicted to close. Today we went into Nottingham to find out the public's opinions. Here's what they had to say. Have you had to change your pandemic night like habits? Yeah, uh, I think I have to take into consideration the effect that going to a party full of a room of people with no masks and no like COVID precautions may have on like vulnerable people and stuff. So I go to significant, like loads of less parties. Go out drinking all the time now. It's not good. Apart from, there's a load more boys now. Mm. Well, Literally girls. <laughs> which I don't understand. I don't necessarily trust the government for what they're saying. However, um, if it's for protecting other people, then I'm not particularly that bothered. There you have it, the students' opinions. This is me, Tilly Hughes, reporting for The Left Lion. Back to you in the studio. Thanks, Tilly. And now for the weather.